Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this challenging logic puzzle. As you can see over here, we have been given very limited information about this puzzle. And here's our puzzle. 4 and 9 give us 20. 8 and 5 yield 14 so 10 and 3 are going to give us what number at this spot can you figure out the answer on your own you may pause the video and take your time so let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first step we are going to look for a certain pattern once we found that pattern we're going to apply and justify now if we look really carefully we can see if we divide this 4 by 2 i'm going to write down 4 divided by 2 is going to give us 2 and at the same time i'm going to multiply 9 by 2 is going to give us 18 now 2 plus 18 equals to 20 likewise i'm going to divide this 8 by 2 that is going to give us 4 and at the same time i'm going to multiply this 5 by 2 that is going to give us 10 so 4 plus 10 is going to give us 14 and if we apply the same analogy over here so 10 divided by 2 is going to give us 5 and at the same time 3 times 2 is going to give us 6 so 5 plus 6 is going to give us 11 so that means the number at this question mark is going to be 11 and here is another approach we are going to take let's look at this first column on the left hand side if we look at this one we can see we got 4 8 10 so that means if i put 6 that makes perfect sense 4 6 8 and 10 if we go on this second column upward we're going to see 3 plus 2 is 5 5 plus 2 is 7 and 7 plus 2 is 9. Now once again we are going to apply the same formula that we applied previously. If I divide this 6 divided by 2 that is going to give us 3 and at the same time I'm going to multiply 7 by 2 is going to give us 14. So 3 plus 14 is going to give us 17 over here and we already know that on this question mark this number is 11 and as if we go upward now we can see 11 plus 3 makes 14 plus 3 is 17 plus 3 is 20 so the common difference is simply 3 and that is consistent 